Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Simone. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Um, today's video is going to be 10 things you don't know about me. Alright, so 10 things you guys do not know about me. Alright, so one, I'm super antisocial. I don't mean to be. I just, I've been bullied like my whole life, like from middle school to high school. It's always something that I've been bullied about and um, I just I felt distant I felt people would like judge me a lot back then and just you know people just hated me I don't even know but yeah so antisocial I wish I had friends but I don't so um that's one thing about me is I just don't know if I know I don't know if I know how to make friends like I don't know like I make them but like they don't stay around I don't know. It's something about me that just doesn't keep friends. <laughs> I don't know. I'm the hugest procrastinator. I procrastinate about 95% of everything. Um, I want so much in life and I have so many goals and I just sometimes don't know where to start. Um, so that can make me procrastinate a whole lot um, and that might be the reason for most of my procrastination. I eat chips on my sandwich yes some people think it's nasty I love it it's just a thing I do I cannot eat my sandwich without chips in my sandwich like it has to be a chip sandwich okay I want to do hair professionally but procrastinating has gotten to that goal as well this one I do my own hair sometimes and I hate it so I don't know how I'm gonna get somebody else hate. Maybe it's the money that's gonna motivate me, right? I went to school for fashion design. I went to the Arts Institute of Dallas um, and it was a whole lot of fun. It was fun. I stay in Dallas, but I was born in Carson, California, and I've also moved to, I also lived in Kansas as well for a couple years, so I've been traveling. Is I want to own my own nail salon, so that's just another goal that I'm going towards, and I think it'll be fun having diversity. A diversity salon you know multiple people who have nail skills not just like because you know you, you just go to Vietnamese people and like I feel like there's so much talent out there they need they shine so I want to open up a nail salon that has a diversity of people working there different ethnicities and colors and just different skills and stuff like that I think it'll be so fun I think it'll be so fun I am so hard on myself about like my weight and how I look, you know. And sometimes I'll, sometimes I'll get like hella dressed just to go to Walmart, and I'm just going to Walmart, you know, going right back home. And it's kind of crazy just because like I'm really insecure. I'm not afraid to say it. I'm very insecure. Like I have a lot of things I'm insecure about. That. I need to change so it's kind of the same thing of what I said in number one I get judged by the way I look I look mean sometimes and that's just like my bitch face that's stuck there and I can't get rid of it I'm literally not making an expression but like a bitch right <laughs> Number 10, I love hip hop, I love country, I love all types of music. I enjoy all kinds of music. Hi. Y'all are so annoying. Grandma. Hey. Hi everybody. How you doing, mama? Mm. We come and ruin your video. Mm. Alright, we leave you now. Mm. 
my favorite club to go to is the Mexican club. I love bachata. Don't girl, girl. Bachata, that's me. That's all me. Like I got that in a bag. And I just think it's fun. I love the Hispanic culture. It's just awesome. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope you guys got to know me just a little bit better and understand what I've been through and what my goals are, you know? Um, and just stay tuned for hella videos. Hella videos coming to you. Um, and yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe and also put on the notifications so you can know when I post a video. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!